welcome to the AgriPhoto YouTube channel. In this video, we visit the Royal Wilhelmina Polder Partnership. It is the largest arable farm in the Netherlands, located in the southwest of the country. The company has a long and interesting history going back to 1809. We visit the farm on a summer's day as the winter wheat harvest is in full swing and stubble cultivation is taking place. Klaas and their Dutch importer, Comster Wield, have lent their top model Lexion 8900 in order to evaluate its performances alongside the farm's own Lexion 780. This 790 horsepower machine was launched in 2019 and upgraded in 2022 for the following harvest. It is still one of the largest combine harvesters currently on the market. The machine is made ready for another harvest day by bringing it into the field and hitching it up to a 12.3 meter wide Vario header. Before harvesting can commence, a moisture test has to be done using a handheld mini combine. As the wheat is still 19% moisture, the crew has to wait a few hours before work can start. This gives us time to visit a brand new outfit that is busy pulling up tram lines. A Fence 728 Vario is hitched up to a brand new 4.5 meter wide Lemkin drill combination that is covering its first hectares. The farm's large-scale fields can be seen from the air. These were all reclaimed from the sea during the 19th century. What is special about this combination is the custom-built Imont subsoiler. Agricultural engineering company Hagro modified so it's now foldable. This one-pass outfit can be used to perform soil loosening and cover crop drilling after harvest. On another field, the farm's 500 horsepower Fent 1050 is working with a Lemkin Carrot 9 cultivator. An oil radish cover crop is drilled in the same pass, and this field of wheat stubble has been fertilized beforehand with farmyard manure. The 1050 is Fent's strongest tractor, and the KMWP was one of the first to own this model in the country. It is the strongest tractor used for heavy tillage tasks such as ploughing and cultivating. Its 12.5 MAN six-cylinder engine produces a very distinctive sound thanks to the low revving concept. It uses two Vario transmissions, which is now a common design on Fent's smaller models as well. When it was launched, already 10 years ago this year, it proved to be a groundbreaking tractor. As the farm's Lexion 780 is also brought to the field and the trailers start to arrive, harvest can begin.
harvest started in the Netherlands in the middle of July, which is relatively early. Due to a wet spring and summer with a lack of sunshine, yields are significantly lower this year compared to what is normal. The 12.3 metre head is a good match for the combine, allowing it to run at around 80% engine load. Yields of 7 to 8 tonnes per hectare are common, which is around 30% lower than average. The 18,000 litre is unloaded at 180 litres per second, and just two loads fill up this 26 tonne Beko trailer. The CMOS system automatically adjusts the machine and helps the operator to gain the maximum capacity and simultaneously the highest product quality. RTK GPS is of course fitted and a grain quality camera constantly checks for broken grains and impurities. Class launched their new Vista Cab on the new Lexion and in 2022 it was given a further update. With a speed of over 6 km per hour, the combine is achieving an average work rate of 7 hectares per hour. The crop is threshed using two drums 170 cm wide. Its diameter has been increased from 60 to 75 cm on this series. This feeds the crop into two 420 cm long rotors. Class calls this APS Synflow Hybrid. Two Fence 724s and one 728 are transporting the wheat back to the farm. There it is, unloaded in the reception pit and stored in the farm's own grain store. The farm has nearly 1,500 hectares of arable crops and wheat is grown on 650 hectares. As the moisture is dropping below the 18% mark, the second combine can also be fired up for some serious harvesting capacity. This Lexion 780 was purchased by the farm in 2015, replacing two smaller combines of a different brand. After nearly 10 years, the farm managers are looking for a replacement machine. Aside from wheat, in barley and field beans are also harvested with this machine. With hot and sunny weather forecast, the farm's team of 13 employees will make the most of the good conditions to finish the wheat harvest in a record pace. We hope that you have enjoyed this insight at the largest arable farm in the Netherlands. Please let us know what you think and we might be back with more videos about this company in the future. Don't forget to like and subscribe and thank you for watching. Goodbye.